haven't seen this before. What is this? Following total atomic annihilation, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. Now, America. Vault-Tec have prepared these educational materials for you <laughs> to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. This is kind of awesome. And now, charisma. And now, what is it made of? Charisma. Unlike the clean, wholesome America you may recall, <laughs> the wasteland will be a distrustful place, full of unsavory characters. <laughs> they look like Flintstones characters. This is so good. Earning the trust of your fellow man is an often overlooked key to survival. One way to prove your trustworthiness is through fair commercial exchange. <laughs> your renowned charisma will enable more favorable bartering. Don't get greedy now. Ah! Use your charismatic nature to negotiate your way out of tense moments. <laughs> Having friends is always of value. Always of value. How else do I find friends, you may wonder. Mm. You may find an impromptu cocktail hour helps to ease social stress. Your charisma will help you avoid <laughs> the perils of addiction but not the immediate effects of drink. So practice moderation. <laughs> or you'll find out who your real friends are the oh, hard dear. way. You will find that even wild animals can be charmed by your charisma. <laughs> Looks like you've this found a new pal. Oh, <laughs> don't get carried away there, big fella. Ah, oh my so God. you see, taking the charismatic approach is more than just good manners. Working with man's best friend into more loyal companions will convincing others to act on your behalf and regularly study your <laughs> vault tech provided materials to prepare uh, for survival. That's so good. And to answer the question, do you know what makes you special? There's something so so magical about that aesthetic, that like 50s uh, or 40s um, uh, like self-help videos. Like, let's talk about communism. It's very bad. Oh, those are good. I hope I get a different one next time. So, okay, so remember the end of the last time I was, uh, I, I was just, uh, I got my new gun nut perk and I had been disassembling and reassembling some guns. So I want to show you the gun that I made. Uh, I am now equipped with, uh, I've, I've upgraded to Charlene and, uh, I have a new rifle. So let's go, um, let's go take a look at those, uh, shall we? Really use your help. Shut up, Settler. Oh, God, what? Just tell me what you need. Just tell me what you need. That's some of the said. nasties live in just around the corner from here. It's only a matter of time before there's some real trouble. What's really too bad is it'd be a nice spot for a new settlement. In fact, I know some folks that'd love to of set up there for the safe. If you can make sure the old workshop there is still in one. Okay. No problem. No problem. I'll... I hope so. We didn't know what to do. You better keep your mouth shut about okay. this place. Okay. All right. So this is Charlene. This is my rifle. There are others like it, but this one is mine. Uh, Charlene comes equipped with a 50 cal receiver, a long barrel, a marksman stock, a large quick eject magazine, a long scope, and a suppressor. This is my long distance headshot machine. She's beautiful, isn't she? I only wish she shot uh, 7.62 millimeter full metal jacket. I also have the cryolator, which I kind of don't really use and I might store. I have this flamer that I found that I might also put away. But the judicious application, I was going to try and call it the judicious application of force, but I couldn't fit all the letters in. So it's just the judicious application of F. Uh, it refills my action points when I crit. And it has a calibrated powerful receiver. It has a short ported barrel. A recoil compensating stock, a large magazine, dot reflex sights, and a muzzle brake. So I am pretty excited about these guns and my new ability to wreck people with them. 
So we're going to go out and do some of that. Now, the only thing is I've only got 22 shots with the 50 cal. So I really need to go and... Uh, I need to really need to go and get some more 50 cal ammo. Um, so let me just put away these. There we go. Uh, also, this is, this is my best friend, Piper. Uh, she's the coolest... Look at how cool she is, just so you know. She's the coolest. Okay, so let's um let's pick a quest and let's get out there everybody. Let's get out in the wasteland and do some good. Um I'm thinking let's just clear up a couple more of these like workshoppy ones just to warm us up, huh? Uh, also yeah, I got a I think I have some ammo in the trunk. I think there's some junk in the trunk. There we go. Uh oops. Yeah, there we go. I don't even need to go buy it. I'm already prepped. I'm prepped and ready. Uh, Jeremiah, Jeremiah Hitchens was asking me, uh, why did you call the gun Charlene? Um, because Charlene is the name of Private Pyle's weapon in uh, one of my favorite movies of all time. Uh, the, um, uh, the, the film Full Metal Jacket. Uh, it is awesome. Okay. Well, cool. I don't even have to go buy stuff. Let's just go and solve some problems. No, I don't want to play some marker. I want to teleport. Let's go to the high school. <laughs> Outlaw country. Yeah, it's the, it's the Shirlene. Okay, so uh, what are we even doing? We're gonna go, go over here. Oh, I gotta reset my um, uh, my quick my my quick weapons. Okay, so this one's already set. This should be number one. And then I want the judicious application to be number two. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, look at this thing. Ba Pow! Oh, it's got one of those the muzzle compensators that shoots the um, the recoil out the sides, so it like stays in the middle. Oh, Cheryl. Yeah, Carol. Cheryl. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> um. So I'm still dressed as the. Uh, I'm still dressed as the silver shroud because it's the coolest clothes that I have so far um, but I think we cut a we cut a striking pair me and Piper with the wasteland weirdos yeah horizontal horizontal vents that's what they're called ah Jamaica Plain <laughs> how did Jamaica Plain well <laughs> first you take some wings and then you take an engine and you put them together and Jamaica Plain. <laughs> Yikes. Ah, uh, that was really cool. She said one more for the obituary. <laughs> oh, Piper, you're clever. Excuse me. Rude. Okay, I need to I need to take some non getting my shit radiated drugs. Oh, there are a lot of ghouls. Oh that's a shame, it doesn't show the horizontal vent in action. I was hoping that the muzzle flash would be different, but I guess not. I always, um, I always kind of like when games prevent the thing that I keep doing, which is, um, reloading partway through a clip by dumping the rest of the clip. 
if you reload. Um, because that's not how people operate guns in real life. You don't fire two shots and then immediately reload. Oh my god, summer shorts. Oh my. Well, that's a hell of an outfit. <laughs> Keep those. This is a daddy o. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, I should go and I should go and get rid of this stuff I'm carrying. I don't really need it. I'm gonna keep those summer shorts though. Um, so to the point, the point being about that other thing I was talking about, about the ammo clip, no, the game, this game doesn't do that, but in some ways I kind of wish that it would. I feel like that'd be a good, that'd be a mod that I would use, just because, um, it always felt like, I don't know, it always felt like a cool way to add some realism to the game and would force you to play the game a little more like a person and a little less like a character in a first person shooter, right? See, so like... Fire two, and then if you reload, you just take the uh, the clip out and chuck it, which you'd never do. Um. Okay, back at Jamaica Plains. So, anyway, we're clearing out the ghouls. Clearing out the ghouls. There's ghouls hereabouts. Yeah, yeah, they could... Oh, Piper. Yeah, they could have the clip drop out and then land on the ground, but I don't know how... See, there I just did it again. I don't know how many, um, how much resources that would take for the game because, you know, it would just add items to the... add items to the world. Still, pretty cool. Candy, a feather duster, and say what, a hundred years, and this place would be right as rain. Yeah, sure. And we could just reconstruct society, get married, and have some babies, and maybe you'd love me, Piper. Piper loves it when I pick locks. Hey, Piper, watch this. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, you like God. that? I know. <laughs> it's sexy. So, you're not an idiot. It's true. <laughs> you too. Uh, thanks. You too. No, I, I didn't mean like... I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue. Is it an issue with sister. how much you love me? Becoming me. <laughs> like a sin? Becoming you how? Becoming you? What do you mean? What do you mean, doll? Terrified she's going to start taking up like her big sis. I mean, think about Side quest. Me. Side no quest. intended, Blue, but... Personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits. It's true. I can't have her ending up like her big sister. Dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off. It's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. The other part of the reason is my sexy butt and how much Maybe I like doing I jet. myself scarce. If I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat. Paper girl and all around upstanding citizen. Oh, that kid is her sister. Well, just love her. You just love her. Family's precious. The last thing you want to do is drive them away because 
you might lose them forever. You're right. I can't risk that. Thanks, Blue. Aw, we you talking. Expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well. They really don't make them like you anymore. <laughs> You're a hell of a friend, you know that? Oh, yeah. Just friends, huh? Uh, well, yeah. I guess. I, I, th I thought so. Unless, you know, something <laughs> changes. God, did it get hot in here? <laughs> hey, thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So, you want to hit the road? You know it's a real weight on my chest? This shirt. Let me just... Yeah, you like that, Piper? Mmm. No? Nothing? Alright, whatever. Fine. Treasures of Jamaica Plain. Come and see the fabulous treasures of Jamaica Plain. The stunning exhibit will be on display for one week only before these priceless items are sealed away, never to be seen again. Sealed away to be protected by top men. Give me that cola. Shit. So unstealthy. Hello is holy fucking shit. That is a system Well, that's a lot of Hi lasers. Alright, well, I feel like it has to be done. Hang on one second, everybody. Uh everybody all right okay all right fine well I'm gonna get all the fiber optics in the world oh god oh god shit Subtle traps. Whoever set this thing up. Subtle fucking traps. Actually, I wanna I wanna load because I, I want all those crystals and stuff. I wanna disarm more of them before they go off and destroy me. Cause I'm pretty good at disarming. I'm just also pretty good at putting my head into the traps. Yeah, give me all that crystal. So if I had 20 crystals before, and I loot 35 more crystals, how many more crystals will I have? See what we're doing here is some crystal math. Yeah, so oh, such loot. Hello, Mr. Laser Cannon. Shit. <laughs> that did not go at all well. Okay, let's try that again. So there's a chance, I guess, to fail to disarm these or something? Or maybe I just walked into one by accident as it was clipping through the floor? Yeah, that's probably what happened. Oh, yeah. Are you proud of me yet, Piper? Look at me disarming these things. I'm so deft. Next, maybe she'll let me disarm her heart. 
I mean, not in a way that she, like it would stop working. That would be bad. I don't. I wouldn't want that. Ooh, a button. Well, I gotta push it. Yeah. Well, that wasn't so hard. Okay. Roll. Has two. Nice. There we go. That was easy. Did you try hacking attempt detected? What? Please remain where you are. We got it. Security personnel will be with you shortly. Okay. That was weird. Hacking attempt detected. Even though I Successfully. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> yeah, successful hacking attempt detected. <laughs> like, that's that's cool. Just fine. It's so weird. Alright, whatever. Whatever, fine game. It'd be like that. Not give me the things I worked so hard for. Sweet. Sweet and adjustable wrench. Piper, Piper, Piper. I got an adjustable wrench. You want, you want to see it? It's pretty cool. <laughs> Okay. Welcome, Arthur. Oh, so it just detects the hacking no matter what. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, that's what we call that's what we call a seven to nine result. Like I got it, I got what I wanted, but no, oh, Piper. Fuck. Come on. Oops, I just took three hits of jet. That's fine. Just jam four inhalers in my mouth. Okay, all right. Hi. Yeah, no, we're good. We're good, man. It's fine. I guess actually I should eat some food. That'll probably be a smarter... Smarter move. So let's eat some food paste? I don't, I don't know. Drink some irradiated blood? That's, that sounds healthy. Yeah. Let's just down an entire thing of soda in one go. Holotape instructions. This is a holotape. Holotapes are laser readable media storage devices. In 2077, we use holotapes to record audio and data files like music, journals, even games. While this may seem primitive to you, 200 years in the future, it was a common and popular technology in our time. The story of a lifetime, the fabled treasure of Jamaica. Oh. <laughs> let's, let's listen. Let's give it a listen. Welcome to the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Within the walls of this time capsule, Yuck, time capsule. We'll find the items and mementos we treasured in the year 2077. Oh, sweet. To you, 200 years in the future, these relics may seem quaint, but we hope that they will remind you on of behalf our place of all of us in 2077. We wish you well. This is Mayor Alyssa Park. 
speaking for the town of Jamaica Plain. All right, church of Jamaica Plain, central tables, holotape instructions, mayor's welcome message, inventory, a bunch of boring shit no one cares about. Mementos of report, Canadian annexation, what? Hmm. I'm sorry, I don't, where, what? Mementos of the Canadian annexation? Prototype biometric scanner, cool. Boon cutter. Oh, it's Tim Pack and some purified water. What oh, weird. Ruined books. Donshire vase. A laundered green dress. Which I already have. Bunch of bullshit. A whole bunch of bullshit. None of this is any good. I mean that bat was cool. Please insert hollow tape. All right. Well, cool. I got a baseball bat. Though I do like the idea of a small chance to send things flying. That seems kind of rad. So I guess people tried to tunnel in or tried tunneled in through that other area. That's cool. Hey Piper, hey Piper, hey Piper, Piper, come here, come watch this. Huh? Yeah. Ah, I mean, no, it's it's cool. I got I got this. I always love how in in like future fiction, like Shadowrun does this too. Like Canada is kind of a footnote. It's like, well, I mean, I don't know, America probably just took it over or it merged with America. Like in Fallout, there's an annexation. In um, in Shadowrun, uh, the United Canadian American States become a thing. Uh, I find it really funny that, that that always happens. Oh God, I don't have time for these log files. Well, maybe I do. Let's take a look at them. I once read, maybe it was in Shadowrun, I once read about um, my my hometown uh, in BC, uh, Kelowna. Uh, I was like, I wonder what happened to Kelowna. I was like, oh, the entire Okanagan Valley was full of radiated waste and everyone died. Great. That's cool. <laughs> Council finally approved renovations to the basement. Told them long enough. Be nice to get rid of those leaky old pipes. Maybe replace the AC so it doesn't flake out every day. It gets above 90. Sick of fixing the darn thing. Got called out to fix the light in the break room. The whole staff was waiting. Turns out today's my 25th anniversary with the city. I'd almost forgot. Had a cake for me and everything. Hard to believe I've spent all those years down here in the basement. Well, once the renovations are done, this old place should be a lot nicer. Hells yeah. Renos. The mayor is out of her mind. All the renovation money's been diverted to our pet project. That ridiculous treasures thing. Just today they ripped up my storage room and started laying in marble floors. Crazy thing I ever saw. What you gonna keep in there? Gold bars? I swear this mess gets worked by the day. They keep badgering me to help with the project, but I don't want none of it. What's wrong with none of it? It's hard enough to keep the place running as it is. First cold day of the fall and the heating system completely shorts out. Plenty of complaints, but at least the temps weren't too bad. Give another month or two, they'll wish they spent some of that money on maintenance. Last week it was Protectron, so we had me set up some highfalutin laser security system. Things touchy as all hell, damn near killed me. I don't get it, they've taken over half the base in this fool thing, they still can't be bothered to shore up the ceiling, or fix the damn plumbing. All that work won't matter much if the whole building collapses on top of it. I can't believe the council's going along with this. Okay. Treasures had all three visitors. Surprised there were that many. Figured the security screenings would keep them away. Mayor tried to put a good face on it for the council, but the city's wasted so much money on this boondoggle. 
I'd be amazed if we don't impeach a lot of them. For now, I'll just try to keep the pipes patched up and the tourists out of my office. Goddamn tourists. I heard it. It's bad outside now. Real bad. Kind of puts things in perspective. There won't be a ceremony tonight. Mayor's probably already dead. I'm going to close up the treasures and try to get out of here. Still the damnest thing I've ever seen, but... Maybe it'll mean something to someone someday. Bum, bum, bum. All right, the janitor. You did good work. And your cool picture of a moose lived on. Weird, huh, Piper? Yeah, that's what I thought. Maybe someday someone will find these treasures and it'll mean something to them. Or they'll just loot the one good item and fuck off. And they'll make fun of me the whole time. Ooh, the mayor's safe. this place. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, I just gotta walk around here until I find the last ghouls. Um, Warblazer uh, was saying in chat that um, that they wonder if they'll ever make a game like Fallout 1 or 2 again. Um, by which I assume you mean in that style, like kind of isometric, turn-based sort of RPG. Um, and I bet they will, but I bet it won't happen for like a while. Uh, and I mean, look, look at Wasteland 2, right? Like it'll be a nostalgia project. Oh, here we go. It'll be a nostalgia project, not a... Um, not like an official thing because the license for Fallout is just too expensive to ever, um, like, yikes, uh, ever get transferred to somebody else. Um, a AAA company will probably always own it. Um, but there is a chance that someone would make a game in the style of, like, look at um, Pillars of Eternity, right? There's a, there's a chance we would get a Pillars of Eternity for the Fallout world, sort of in the style, like a post-apocalyptic game like that, but, you know, it wouldn't be Super Mutants and Jet and the Brotherhood of Steel, but, and that kind of, that kind of thing. Like, it just wouldn't, because that's not, I don't know, it's, it's, it would be expensive, right? For the same reason we don't get uh, Dune games. Or Lord of the Rings games by indie developers, because that shit's way too expensive. Jamaica Plane, Mayor's Password, Sal's Holotape, some missiles. Sure, wow, you got a lot of cool shit. And then a full suit of combat armor. What did I pick out? Sal's hollow tape. Here we go. Damn it, worthless bastards! Scattered like rad roaches the moment they saw the first ghoul. I've spent months prepping for this op. There's no way I'm backing out now. That treasure will be mine. 
Even if I have to dig it up with my own bare hands. Yeah, dude, it's not. I'm sorry. It's not armor, or it's not. It's not treasure. Also, I'll take all this stuff and give it to Piper. Piper. Pipes. Piperino. Buffet. Hey, Piper. Hey. Just let me know. Don't mind the clutter. What, in your inventory? I don't. I'm not in your apartment. Thank you, Piper. Appreciate that. Preesh. All right, so now we have the mayor's password. Let's see what the mayor had to say. Treasures exhibit speech. Okay, budget statement. Let's see. Uh, property taxes, 190 mil. Income tax, 87 mil. Revenue sharing, 150 mil. License fees and charges, 140 mil. Total, 560 odd million dollars. Oh, they were in the hole. They were in the hole by like 10 million bucks. Treasures exhibit special funding, thirty-eight million dollars. Well, the safe is already unlocked, so Friends, neighbors, and honored guests, we are here today to commemorate the treasures of Jamaica Plain. Though ours may be a small community, it is rich in history, rich in culture, rich in memory. And for the sake of those memories, we commit these treasures to the earth, that future generations might look back and remember where we stood and see how far they have come. That's okay. Great. You were yep, really into your community. <laughs> okay. Well, wow, that's really cool. Okay, let's go back and turn that quest in, or do whatever it is we need to do. Oh no, we still there's still ghouls to be found. Still quests to be done. There we go. Oop. Nope, you got this. Or not? Okay. Back we go. To sanctuary. Alright, give me some of that XP, you yeah, I cleared that place out for you. Should be safe for your friends to move in now. Nice to have some good news around here for a change. Yes. Yes, it is. I agree. All right. What else we got, quest-wise? Sanctuary Hills. Talk to. Oh, I gotta finish this one. I gotta talk to Preston. Hey, Preston, I did a thing. <clears throat> Can I have some more experience, please? The no. The Minutemen are on a roll. That's fantastic news. Mm -hmm. I'll let you know if I hear of any stuff. In the meantime. Yeah. Alright, uh, let's do... God, I pretty much only have... I pretty much only have, like, miscellaneous quests. Yeah. Uh, I kind of want to just like wander around. Uh, let's let's pick something far away and go to it, and like actually walk there. Let's see what Ten Pines Bluff has. Uh, it's so close. Oh, I just did that one. I already owned that that area. Let's do something else. Let's do... what should we do? Should I do a miscellaneous thing? Let's talk to some people. 
Because a lot of these are just, um... Yeah, like, regular type ones. Okay, let's go, um, let's do the combat. What's that combat zone one? I'm gonna check that out. Or I could just start walking. Fuck it. Let's, let's just pick an area and go to it. Where's an area I haven't been? A lot of empty space. Let's see. Kind of in this zone, maybe? Yeah, let's just go... Let's go and explore this area. So... We'll just go south. Actually, let's, let's have a nap first, because I want to I wanna walk around during the day so we can actually see. And I want to clear my radiation problem. There we go. Feels good, man. Ah, yeah. Well rested. Well rested. We're out, in, out into the wasteland fog. Let's see, where's o Overland? Was it Overland Station? Where is where's that one? Because I think that might be on the way, or it might be a place I can go walk to. Yeah, perfect. Okay, let's walk there. Let's see what... The cow's going ham over there. Look at this fine, crappy wooden bridge we have. Goodbye, Sanctuary Town. We're going on an adventure. And the wasteland's cool looking. I think that's like dawn mist. Yes, it's a beautiful day to be traveling the wasteland, looking for drugs, people to shoot with our sniper rifle. Truly, it is a fine time to be alive. That's actually pretty fucking gorgeous. What are you shooting at, Piper? Oh, the dough. Why? Why, Piper? Why? How's my jet supply? How's my jet supply doing? Jesus Christ! I only have sixteen jet left. Oh no! No, oh, no! What am I gonna do if I run out of drugs? I'm like legitimately concerned. Gonna hunt this. Gonna hunt this school. Where is he? Okay, he's over there. Shit. Oh god, that is disgusting. Blah. I kinda didn't, I kinda got messed up and you saved my butt. But whatever, if you wanna give me credit for it, that's... It's fine. Good in here. 
chemistry station that I can't use? Oh, hi. Wake up! Time to die! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that'd be so rough. Like, what the fuck? Somebody in my house? Oh, shit, shooting me. Like, I don't know, somebody's in my house. So I went blay, I'm shot in the face. Jet fuel? Flamer fuel and jet. Okay, so how is this better than regular jet? Like, in every way, basically? Slows time. 35 max AP and increased AP regen for 8 minutes. Oh, neat! And it lasts extra time because I have chemist, maybe? That's pretty cool. Alright. Keep that in mind. Um, actually, I want to see, what do I need to make, like, actual jet? <sighs> fertilizer and plastic. I need so much fertilizer. So much fertilizer. I'm, so, I'm really starting to worry about about my jet supply. I don't have jet lag. I should. I should tag it for search. That's a really good point. Uh, let's run back there. Where's that little shit shack? Oh, no. Is this a different shack? What the hell? <laughs> Or was I just on the roof? Yeah, it was, that was the roof of that one. Okay. I was very confused. Okay, so... How do I... Tag for search. There we go. Perfect. Thank you. Oh, and you can do it from the inventory? Neat. Okay, cool. I didn't have to run back. But I got to go to the top of the shack, so... You know, worked out for the best. Worked out for the best for everybody. <gasps> Legendary gunner. Oh, boy. This is gonna go poorly for me, I bet. Come on, motherfucker. Wow! <laughs> awesome. 50 cal sniper rifle shot to the chest. Oh, it's so satisfying. Anybody else want some? Yeah, you want a little? God, it's like shooting into the sun. I don't. Get some fucking sunglasses up in this piece. God, that's such a good sound, that like snap. Yeah, okay, step one, do a bunch of jet. Step two, stare directly into the sun. Step three, probably superpowers. Like I had a lead pipe. Alright. Not much of a gunner. Oh. 
Piper, can you carry this for me? Heads up. Piper, Piper, Piper. Piper, I'm, I'm, I'm overladen with stuff. I mean, if you're gonna plan an ambush at, in the morning, this is a pretty much perfect place to do it because that was really rough having to shoot into the sun. So, good work, Gunners. There's like a Gunners glasses joke in here somewhere, but I couldn't be bothered to make it. Where did those corpses get off to? Were they blown clear by the explosion? Seriously, there were like two more gunners on that bridge and then the thing went off. Uh. Kitties! What in the shit? <laughs> I love it. Well, pastor's vestments. Oh, damn. Gonna be high priest to the wasteland. Nice. That's pretty cool. Piper, we're gonna play dress up again. Piper, pipes, pipe, pipey. Come here. The crazy cat cleric house. Heads up. Here, I have uh, I have a new outfit I want you to try on, see how you look. I mean, she's not gonna look as cool. Look at her side-eyeing me. It's a cool outfit. I definitely like the tuxedo better, but... Look alive. Shoot. Sure, take a peek. Oh, I will. Oh, he's chewing on a little rocket ship. Adorable. It's <laughs> so weird. Okay. Let's keep going. <laughs> I just did it to see if I could. I like that the suppressed rifle is still like quite a loud snap. Oh shit. Uh it's not just like a Yeah, the 50 cal round that I shot at that bird was probably as big as the bird itself. Eat some of this stuff. What the fuck, Piper? What are you screaming about? What? What? Damn. 
Okay. Alright. Seem to have found like a little gunner's base. I guess this is the other side. Yeah, this is the other side of that entrance I came up before. Okay. Uh, let's... Let's keep going. Let's go back down. Yeah, I can pretty much one-shot any, like, regular human target that's not, like, super heavily armored or, like, physical attack resistant. Uh, it's just a regular 50 cal rifle. It's a sniper rifle that I've upgraded a ton. I got, uh, gun nut up to three so far and have just been upgrading the damage that it does. It does about 107 damage, I think. Right now, anyway. Hear that helicopter sound? Some randos. I've been thinking about this for a long time. Oh, what's up? Time. Are you a quest? I know what I'm talking about. Bullshit. You can't just put stuff out on two pieces of bread and claim it's a sandwich. Oh. Does that mean a loaf of bread is technically a bread sandwich? Technically, <laughs> yes, but you wouldn't eat it all at once like that, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> How you hold it matters. Now keep talking about sandwiches. What the hell would you call it then? Disgusting. That's <laughs> Uh-huh. Hi. Huh? Huh? Hey. Yeah? I like your bandana, Mikey. Yes? Shh. Shut up, Piper. Oh, welcome back, Demos. Thank you. <laughs> I love that. I mean, he's right. It is a sandwich. I mean, two pieces of bird, two pieces of bread with a sandwich in it. Make a sandwich, you eat it, it's terrible. A loaf of bread is technically a bread sandwich. It's a multi-stack bread sandwich. <laughs> Weird. Turns out, even after the nuclear apocalypse, People still have weird bullshit conversations about stuff. Okay, I'm gonna take some rad away and I'm gonna. Or rad X, I'm gonna jump in that water. Let's do it. Ugh, <laughs> <laughs> gross. Yeah, those vertebrates, they're everywhere. I don't... If they're not stopping to harass me or they're not shooting at anything, I, it doesn't really matter to me. That was a cool trip. There we go. Oberland Station. Well, these guys have got a lot of food. Hi. Did the Minutemen send you? Yep. Of course. Just tell me what you need help with. There's a tell me what you need help with. Stealing our food and supplies. Ah, wow, backstreet you know apparel. Where coming from, but we can't. Uh huh. Don't worry. I hope so. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. 
Excuse me. Oh, man, I'm sorry, everybody. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go do the thing that I do. Kill. Just don't worry about it. Go ahead, Dapa, do it. I'm gonna get it, dude. You guys got any jet? It's like a really use some. What is this? Is this a crashed alien spaceship? <sighs> is this a crashed alien spaceship? God, crashed alien spaceship! How do I loot it? Give me, give me the fucking stuff. Alien goo. Zetons or Thetans or whatever they're called. Get out of the way. Oh, I'm so excited. Crashed alien spaceship. Oh, sweet. Thank you. Aw. Crashed alien spaceship. <laughs> well, Pythagoras, I'm, I'm glad that... Sorry, I went to, to check Pythagoras' donation. I'm glad you appreciate Howard. Uh, I think if you um, if you watch the uh, the GM turn uh, for Swan Song, uh, he will be making a comeback fairly soon. Um, yeah, let's go follow that goop. I got a fucking goop quest. All right, is there is there a trail? Is there a blood trail from this crashed alien spaceship? I was bummed when I was playing Fallout 2 and I never discovered the the alien crash. My luck wasn't high enough, I guess. I need more goo. Oh, there it is. Okay. Crash alien spaceship. Where's the next goo? I feel like this is where I need Geralt style powers. The alien went this way. Oh, a cave. All right, let's go. Crashed alien spaceship. Dun dun dun. Ooh, this is cool. Yes. Oh yeah, look at that alien over there. Is he just gonna straight up attack me? Don't attack me, dude. I came to save you. Oh, okay, fine. Discover alien cultures and interesting people and kill them. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that fucking thing. <gasps> pew 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 pew. Free for the table. Yo. Psst. What you got from me? Piper, here, take this alien blaster pistol. That's cool. It's a shame you can't talk to him, though. I was hoping I could talk to the alien, but... Well, I guess this is how we communicate here in the wasteland we communicate with. Power comes from the barrel of a fun. Hey, is that a vault? Oh, cool. Oh shit. Alright, let's go check that out. What time is it? I got lots of time. Let's go. Let's go check out a vault. Actually, we don't. We should take a break. But I'm too excited. Illuminated. Here it comes. Vault, everybody. I'm sure it's up here somewhere. Is that a Yaogwai? Oh, I think it might be. Yeah, it is. Fuck. Woo! Hells yeah, Piper! You done good. Vault 81. Awesome. 
Okay, well, all right, now now we can take a break. We got a, we got a vault. We are ready to explore. And uh, let's take a, take a five-minute break, and we'll go check it out right after this.